coming up on Cardinal TV. Hello, my name is Paul Revere. I was born like Not one, not two, but three Mentor School student groups were selected to showcase their work at a huge school conference in Columbus, Ohio. We'll take you there. Plus, have you heard your students talking about the school's makerspace but wonder what it is? We'll show you. But first, when it snow, snow and he blends in. We have to tell you about a huge honor earned by our integrated preschool program. Hello, and thank you for watching. I'm Matt Miller, Superintendent of Mentor Public Schools. We all know how important it is that children develop a love of learning as early as possible, and I'm proud to announce our preschool program is being recognized for doing just that. Due to the commitment to high quality and ongoing dedication to the learning and development of children, our preschool program has received a five-star Step Up to Quality Award from the state of Ohio. That's the highest rating you can receive. Our preschool is housed at Ridge Middle School, and our teachers and support staff work diligently to create great opportunities for the children of our community. Our first initial reaction was, was nervousness because, of course, we wanted to prove we were capable of earning that five stars. But what it really did was we sat down and we talked about all of the great things we do in our program, and it really got us excited because we knew we did good things, but when we sat down and talked about it and put it down on paper, we just really felt so proud of, of our program and of each other. Congratulations to our staff for all the hard work every day that led to earning this top honor. 30 of our students traveled to Columbus to showcase their excellent work to school officials from all across the state. You're looking at video from the annual Student Achievement Fair at the Ohio School Board Association's Capital Conference, which draws thousands of school board members and administrators together each year for idea sharing. Being selected to participate in the Student Achievement Fair is a big honor, and we were proud to have three groups go. They were the Historical Wax Museum from Bellflower Elementary School, the Robotics Club from Brentmore Elementary School, and our Construction Management Career Technical Education Program. The students were excellent representatives of Mentor Schools. My favorite thing about the Wax Museum is just telling people how stuff to happen in history. I like programming the most in this club, and I also, I'm also in this club because I love math. All of the groups did a great job showing their work as people moved throughout the fair. The construction management students were running a hammer and nail challenge, which was a big hit among folks wanting to test their skills. A lot of fun and a lot learned by all. Hands-on learning is certainly a way to keep students engaged in school, and our maker spaces are a great example of that. Here's a look at the maker space at Ridge Middle School where the staff wrote several grants to create this area. You can see it's a combination of high-tech and low-tech tools and options for students to create, build, and explore. This learning environment builds critical thinking, communication, and collaboration skills for students, all the while teachers deliver content that meets our district's curriculum standards. The thing that I think is most exciting is the opportunity of making math alive. Um, science, it's really easy to do that. Art, it's really easy to do that. But when you can take kids um, who struggle with math and put them in and they learn and they light up on their face because they finally get it seeing and touching, it's awesome and just really encouraging as an educator. Ridge is not the only school with a makerspace. We have started to build one at the high school as well, with the goal of expanding to more schools as we can. All of our schools found different ways to honor our nation's veterans on Veterans Day a couple of weeks ago. As this is such an important lesson for our students to celebrate the brave men and women who choose to serve our country in the United States military. The video you're seeing now is from the special ceremony that was held at Sterling Morton Elementary School. Local veterans were also invited to join some students for breakfast before the all-school assembly. And this ceremony was held at Menor High School. Many local veterans also attended alongside our students. A special thanks to local VFW Post 9295 for presenting the colors and to all of our guest speakers who provided great messages and stories for our students to hear. This wraps up today's video update. 
Thank you for your continued support of our students, staff, and school district. We'll see you again real soon.